Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum and a very good day to you all. Okay, for this video, we are going to do example 8.1 from the chapter 8 screw. Okay, uh, all the example is called content. I take from the book Shigli Mechanical Engineering Design. And all the images here, I take from uh, Google Images. Okay, so let's begin. Okay, the example 8.1. Okay, is given double thread screw has a major diameter 32mm and pitch of 4mm with double threads and it is used to an application similar in figure 8.4. This is the figure, okay, this is a power screw mentioned. Okay, imagine this, this is, uh, this is the picture. Okay, the data include friction, a friction of color 0 0.08 and uh, diameter of root. DC is the meter of color. DC is the meter of color is 40 millimeter and force is uh, 6.4 kilonewton per screw. Okay, so A is find the depth trap, uh, trap depth. Uh, B is find the torque. C is find the efficiency. D is find the body stress. E is finding the bearing stress. F finding the trap bending. G determine the volumetric stress and H determine the maximum shear stress. Okay, take the take the calculation pen and uh, calculator to you and you have should, should have um, uh, papers to write and if you have a textbook uh, it's better to have the textbook with you so because you can refer. Okay, thread depth. What is thread depth? Okay. Thread depth is, uh, you see the picture I take from, uh, randomly from Google Images. This is the picture. Uh, this is the depth. Okay, this is the depth. Uh, if you can see here, this is the depth. Okay, the depth. Depth of the thread that you want to calculate. So, dm is the uh, diameter of the, the screw itself. Okay, the the minor diameter of the screw itself, okay, you can see if you can measure that this minor diameter, uh, what is the main, this minor diameter, uh, then you can get within uh, this equation diameter of the root minus the diameter of, uh, of the minor diameter and you can get the root is, uh, the tap drag is 8 millimeter. So the question B asks us to find the torque required to turn the screw against the load. Okay. So the torque. Uh, remember the equation for torque is torque equals to force times radius. So what is the torque uh, you need to to, uh, to to pull the screw? Okay. To rotate the screw. This is the given for the equation TR equals to F dm over 2 uh, L and until, uh, until F uh, friction of color DC okay diameter of color over 2 and you put the, all the information given here and you get the the 26.18 Newton meter this is the top and uh, the minus sign uh, in the first term indicates the screw alone is not self-locking and will rotate under the action of load except the fact the color friction is present must be overcome. Okay. The screw is not self-locking. Okay. Your answer uh, here, this answer, negative 0 0.46, meaning that the screw is not self-locking. Uh, self-locking. I give you the example of this. Okay, if you pull down and you cannot go anymore, you cannot you you cannot uh, you cannot tighten up anymore. It is self locking. Okay. So the overall efficiency is raising the load is you E equals to F L over two pi torque. Okay, torque to the raise of the load. Meaning, raising of the load must not be confused to raising anything. You know? Meaning that if you find it harder, let, let, for example, this. 
I will I tighten up the this uh, this water uh, tumbler. It is harder to push to to tighten anymore. Harder to tighten anymore. I am raising the load. If my hand is strong enough, I put push together and maybe it will damage the trap. Okay. Now raising the load. If you are giving the load, not all not meaning that you raise something up. Okay, not meaning that you are raising something up. No, you are giving force to the screw. This is what they mean by raising the load. Okay, the body shear stress due to the total the moment of the screw body is shear stress equal to 16 over ni. Uh, then you can get 6.07 megapascal. Okay. The bearing stress is the one of the track carrying 0 0.38 uh, uh, force. Okay, the bearing stress, just want to uh, remind you, the bearing stress is like this. You give, this is the track. This is uh, this is the screw. This is what the screw clamp. Okay, the stress, the stress in contact with the screw, contact with the plate. This is called the bearing stress. Okay, and then you give it for the mathematic. Uh, they have done research. Uh, the stress given or the first track is 0 0.38 force. Okay, the, okay, this is the track. Okay, this is track. Usually the first track is here. Okay, this is the first one. It's called the uh, 0 0.38 force given at this one. So this track will damage first. May damage first if uh, something happens to that. So the thread bending stress with one carrying uh, 0 0.38 F is uh, this is the one okay thread bending stress you put in this, this equation you get 41.5 megapascal okay so so huge the force the force is so huge uh. the traverse the transverse stress at the extreme of the road uh, cross section due to bending is zero however there is uh, a certain Conferential shear stress at the extreme of the root across the section of the track as shown in part D of uh, part D of uh, six point zero seven megapascal, meaning that the previous solution solution D, the three dimensional stress after figure eight eight noting why the coordinate is in, into the page uh, given uh, stress for x stress for y stress for z. Okay, for the metabolic stress, you put in the equation. Okay, you put in this equation, can be written as this, and you can get uh, 48.7 megapascal. And ordering the principal stress given uh, this this value, you put in this equation, you get uh, 48.7 megapascal. Okay, so the maximum shear stress is given by equation 3.16. Where stress maximum shear stress maximum is shear stress one over three, giving shear stress maximum is like this. Okay, uh, stress one minus stress three can get it, and you can get the maximum shear stress is twenty seven point three megapascal. So that's all for the video or for the calculation. Uh, try practice, try practice uh, more. Okay. Uh, and we continue in the next video on threaded fastness. Thank you very much.